symptoms I should be worried about after eating this is like suddenly my muscles aren't working. I can't uh, move. Yes, puffer fish poison is uh, very, very dangerous. Have you ever heard of a meal so dangerous it can kill you within hours? Imagine a dinner that turns into a deadly nightmare. A seemingly normal family gathering that ends in tragedy. Today we're diving into the chilling story of a woman and her two children who ate a meal that claimed their lives, all because of one fatal mistake. Let me introduce you to the pufferfish, also known as fugu in Japan. At first glance, it's just another creature of the ocean, but lurking inside is a deadly toxin called tetrodotoxin, a poison 1,200 times more lethal than cyanide. Scene. Just one fish contains enough poison to kill 30 adults. So why on earth do people eat it? All right, here we go. How do you feel? Well, fugu is considered a delicacy in Japan. It's a rare dish served only by licensed chefs who go through years of training to safely prepare the fish. But there's a catch. If even the slightest mistake is made while removing the toxic parts, the result can be fatal. And that brings us to the heart of today's story. It was 1975 in Japan, when a man, eager to impress his family, decided to prepare a meal of fugu for his wife and two children. This man wasn't a trained chef, but like many, he had heard about the fame and excitement of fugu and thought, how hard can it be? He managed to buy a pufferfish from a local market. Despite knowing the dangers, he decided to try his hand at preparing the fish for dinner. His wife trusted him. The kids were excited. They sat down at the table ready to enjoy their meal, completely unaware of the danger that lay ahead. The moment the family took their first bites, they didn't notice anything wrong. The fish tasted just fine. But soon after, the woman and her children began feeling strange, tingling sensations in their lips, dizziness, and shortness of breath. The toxin had begun to take effect. Tetrodotoxin works quickly. It paralyzes the muscles, making it impossible to breathe while the person remains fully conscious, trapped in their own body. There's no antidote, and survival depends on immediate medical intervention, which in this case, didn't happen. Within hours, the mother and her two children were dead. News of the tragedy spread across Japan, sparking shock and horror. How could something so preventable happen? The husband was devastated. His desire to impress his family had cost them their lives. An investigation was launched, but it was clear. The family had fallen victim to the deadly toxin in the fish a result of an untrained hand attempting to handle one of the world's most dangerous delicacies. Since then, Japan has enforced even stricter regulations on fugu preparation. Only chefs who have completed rigorous training and passed tough exams are allowed to prepare it. These chefs learn how to remove the toxic organs, the liver, ovaries, and intestines with precision. A single slip could be deadly. But despite the danger, fugu remains popular. People flock to restaurants to experience the thrill of eating something that could, in the wrong hands, be fatal. In fact, some say the thrill of danger is what makes it taste even better. This story isn't just about a deadly fish. It's about the risks we take, and sometimes the irreversible consequences of underestimating danger. The husband's decision to prepare the fish himself was rooted in love and excitement, but it ended in unimaginable tragedy. It's a powerful reminder that sometimes, expertise should never be substituted with confidence alone. What happened to that family could have been avoided, and today their story serves as a somber warning. Some risks are simply not worth taking. Now what do you think about fugu? Would you try it, knowing the risks involved, or would you steer clear? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And if you enjoyed today's video, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.